like you said, I'm Mark Nielsen. I'm creative manager at Public Supermarkets. Uh, so we have an in-house creative group. Um, it's about 55 people. We've got roughly 30 something that are in design. So we've got a uh, creative director, three creative managers. So basically creative manager is Publix's term for an uh, associate creative director. Um, and then we've got, so on those three teams, we've got about, uh, I've got like nine designers and a writer per team. And then we've got environmental designers, um, production artists, ad production, etc. I started at Publix in 1999, been there almost 10 years, it'll be 10 years in September. Started in ad production, went on to uh, package label, and then you know, where I did a lot of private label work for Publix brands, and then you know, graphic design, senior designer, now creative manager. So this is aluminum foil that we did for the redesign of Publix brand. Um, now Publix brand used to be, Publix private label products, used to be like a direct knockoff of the competitor. So if it was Ritz crackers, then um, the Publix brand crackers looked just like Ritz. I mean, it was just no thought behind it. Um, our creative director one day in about 2002, I think, just came in and said, you know, we don't want to do this anymore. Let's do something better. Um, so we kind of started this project and we really felt like we wanted to get something that was, um, we felt like in the retail world, in the supermarket, that um, the products that really, I don't know, they kind of screamed at you, you know what I mean? So everybody was competing for space. And every, so because of that, you couldn't differentiate one from the other. So we went in and said, all right, well, let's uh, create kind of this calm space within the shelf. So not just the package, but the whole shelf. And then that'll really help you to find uh, the Publix brand products. And it was received really well, not only by our customers, but also in the design world. Um, this, these designs were in communication arts. Beyond that, we've also done uh, some limited edition packaging, so we can do, it's not all, you know, corporate, you know, so this was kind of a fun project. Uh, so that's one of the toffee apple limited edition ice cream. This is a blueberry waffle cone, just completely different, you know, it's only on the shelf for three months. Um, this was a project we did. I worked with another designer and a writer, and we did um, this brand challenge. It was a program that we were launching uh, at that time where if you bought, you know, a bottle of a jar of ragu and then we would give you a Publix brand for free so you could see that it's just as good. So we kind of did this, you know, battle of the brands, old boxing poster kind of feel to it. And then this was a cookbook. I'll be going into a case study about this um, for Thanksgiving, gathering Thanksgiving meals and memories. And then we'll also be talking about this project, a back to school mailer.